Hello friends, welcome to my channel Creative Art. My name is Nilima and today we are going to make this beautiful glass jar in very few simple steps. This was a empty jam jar which I have converted into this beautiful vessel. You can use it by planting some plants or plant a flower in it, keep a flower, use it as a vessel or you can also insert some beautiful jelly balls or place a beautiful candle and and make it full use for your decor so let's start making friends first of all we'll need favorite glass colors which are water based I'm using and this is 261 metallic gold Camlin glass liner a glass vessel you can use any shape you want a string glue gun cutter pevicol scissor and plant or as flower whatever you want to plant in this vessel okay so we'll first of all start by heating up our glue gun so here you can see that our glue gun is ready it is heated up i'll first of all apply some hot glue on a corner and then i'll start wrapping my string from here We'll cut it. Okay, so the use of glue gun is done now. We'll clean the edges. You can do it using a scissor or simply using your hand. using a metallic gold liner now first of all we'll cover the edges and if somewhere remaining you can also fill it up with the golden liner so you can see the ring is completed now we'll make now we'll start making some small flowers you can make any shape you want So friends, here you can see that our lining part is completed and I'm showing you the final design how this looks so that we may start coloring. First of all, I have selected two colors. Uh, this is a green color and a red color. We'll take the green color and fill up the small leaf parts first. Very gently you have to place the color and as you know, this is not a plain surface. You have to hold it till it gets dried up do not color a lot use a very little amount of color so that you can avoid the flow if there are any bubbles remove it using cotton board and we'll let it dry now now using the red color you can fill up the coloring parts of the flower you have to use the minimum amount of color so that it may not flow out now we'll let this side get dried up first and then we'll color all the rest remaining sides and i'll show you how does it looks okay So here is our coloring part completed. You can see we'll let it get dry for some time and then I'll show you how does it looks with a few flowers or the plants. Okay. 
so friends this is how a beautiful glass jar looks when we have painted it and i have also placed a beautiful yellow color flower in it to decor it and now i'm going to place it beside my window wall there you can see there is a bamboo plant and also few beautiful daffodils decorated with it okay if you did like this video friends please do like and subscribe my channel thank you for watching